But yeah, so I'm gonna be showing you guys the equipment I'm gonna be using for my cut. The circuit trimmers, circuit balders. I got my little brush through here. Then we got the one guard, two guard, three guard, four guard, and the A and B, which is basically the um, zero guard and the one and a half guard. But before we start, let's vibe. Let's vibe real quick. Turn up. ready, Chris? how I made a little like triangle shape right like that and then we are going to grab the we're gonna grab the shavers we're gonna shave all the way up and you're gonna kind of want to you're gonna want to leave half an inch of where you cut the hair so you, you it can it can blend better so you're gonna leave half an inch So it blends, and then we're gonna later hit it with a trimmer. So you hit it with a close, zero guard, or no guard, up to the line. Uh, 
And then now you're gonna hit it with the shimmers all the way to the line, but you're gonna go up before the line and you hit it to the line so it blends that line out fully. Alright, so now you wanna get a one guard, put it on, clippers, and then you're gonna open it and keep that rainbow shape and you're gonna go half up half an inch again. And then after hitting it with an open, you're gonna close and hit the line. And you're gonna close the one guard and you're gonna hit the line up, a little uh, above the line. And then I'm gonna go with the A guard or the half, the zero guard, and you're gonna hit it after that. So close your one and hit it past the line a bit. And then you're gonna get the egg guard or half moon guard and you're gonna hit the line past up a bit. And then after that, I'm gonna just touch it up to see how there's just a little bit of a line right there. I'm gonna touch it up with an open, try to get rid of that line. Alright, so what I'm just trying to do now is detail around here, and I'm gonna fade up. I'm gonna go with a two around here, but I'm just trying to fix the detail over here. See some dark spots? You're just gonna play with the lever. You just gotta remember your guidelines. So you remember whether, like, before the guideline, let's say you went with uh, a no guard and a one, and there's some dark spots in between. You go with a no guard and you just play with the lever. All right, since I'm done with that, now I'm gonna go with a two around here, and I'm gonna fade it up, and I'm gonna finish it by just flaring it out, and I might have to touch it up with a B, which is a one and a half guard, I think. So yeah, so I'm gonna go with a two around here. All right, so now you can see I went around it, right here with a two. You can see there's a line right here. I'm gonna fix that with a B. So you get the B guard, close, and you flick up to the line. So now I'm just gonna touch it up, see it's still a little dark. I'm gonna open, I'm gonna close from the, oh shoot. I'm gonna have the one open, but close it just a tiny bit to fix that dark spots around here, and finish that out. Yep, so we're just about done with this. There's a little dark spot right there. I'm gonna touch it up though, so. We're about done with the burst on the right side. So now I'm just gonna line it up. I'm gonna line up like this. I'm gonna, when I line up my hairline, I usually hit it straight on. And then when I hit it right here, I make sure that it's straight here. And I make sure it's straight right here. And I cut it and then I connect it in the middle. So it doesn't look too thick, you know what I mean? So I'm gonna touch it up here first. And touch up here and then meet it in the middle. Alright, so now I have my line up done. Right there, got the line. Some burst, tape it right there. Now we're gonna go on the other side. Alright, so now you're basically just gonna start again with the triangle shape burst right here, right there. Just basically the same thing I did on this side, on this side. So a triangle like this, boom, and then you're just gonna go the same steps. So now since we have that line right there, you're gonna hit it with the trimmer and go up half an inch where we leave half an inch up here. The reason why I say half an inch is because it makes the blend easier and doesn't leave a harsh like guideline like at the bottom right there. And then now we're gonna hit it with a half um, no guard 
all the way open and go up half an inch. And then you're gonna go half lever open, go halfway and then close it at the line. Now since you're done with that, you're just gonna hit it with a trimmer to the line to get that line fully out. Now you're gonna go with the one guard, all the way open, and go in the rainbow shape half an inch around the um, no guard. And now going half an inch around, you're gonna close it at the line. And after hitting that, you're gonna go with the A guard or your half an, or zero guard, and you're gonna get that line out by hitting it up to the line and flick out. All right, so now you're gonna go with the two, open all the way around, half an inch above the one. All right, so now after hitting it with a two with a close at the line, you're gonna flick out that line, get the line out with the one or one and a half guard or mine is a B guard, so get, get that line out right there. And to get rid of that line fully, I'm gonna go with a one guard and close it just a tiny bit from the open. Just close it just a tiny bit and get that line out. All right, so now it's done from this side. It's not gonna show a bit with the light. And also with this side, my hair pattern is just a little weird. So I still have to learn how to cut, you know, a little better on this side, but I'm done with this side. So now I'm gonna give myself a line. So I'm gonna match up my hairline. So right here, I wanna match up. So I'm gonna have to push it up a bit. And then I'm gonna start on the side, right here. And then on the C cup. And then you meet in the middle of the C cup right there. Ooh. And now I'm gonna do my lineup. I haven't done my lineup in so long, but you know what I'm saying? I'm just gonna line it up for you guys. So I'm gonna water down my hairline with the spray, brush down, and basically start in the middle and then go to left and right. Alright, so I finished my lineup, but I haven't lined myself up in so long. But yes, that's how it's looking. And yeah, so now I'm a straight razor. Alright, so now we're gonna straight razor. So I have the straight razor here and um, the cream, the aftershave cream. But I don't recommend to this to anybody that does not feel comfortable or still beginning out. I would say first practice or get some help or do. Um, I would say if you're starting a straight razor and you've never done it before, don't cut yourself yet. Practice like on your wrist and glide like across or search up other videos, but don't do it yet if it's your first time. So I've been doing this for a long time, or not a long time, I've been doing it for a couple cuts now, so I kind of feel comfortable. So I'm a straight razor, put cream first, and then, I mean, I'm gonna put the gel first and then straight razor here all the way around, straight razor up. And the thing is you wanna glide across at an angle. Yeah, that's gonna be the final. I got the blade out. I mean, honestly, this is not my best cut. My cut last week was better, but yeah, I just feel like, I don't know. This is how I just get my tapers, guys. I'm gonna be doing some more videos on these, get some more haircuts to show you guys. So now I'm gonna take it out and show you guys the product. So that's gonna be the end of this video. Make sure you guys go like, subscribe, turn on post notifications. And if you guys made it this far, spam up best haircut or taper haircut. Spam that up right now. That's how I know if you made it towards the end. 10K subscribers, we almost there. You know, we gonna be the strongest family on YouTube. I swear to God, we're gonna be the strongest family. But make sure you go do all that. If you ain't Steve's gang, you lame. But if I keep forgetting, I keep forgetting. If you ain't Steve's gang, you lame. Grrr.